What's going on everybody? Suro here. Welcome back to the channel. Today I want to share with you a game I'm very excited for. It is Project Playtime. So this of course is a variant of the game Poppy Playtime. It's by the same makers of course and it is something really unique. So the other games were a linear game. This is a multiplayer horror game where six players attempt to create one giant toy while surviving a terrifying monster that roams the toy factory. So you're gonna have six players and one of them is going to be a monster. So seven in total, six survivors, one monster. Now there are three different monsters in this game that you can play as, and that is Huggy Wuggy, Mommy Long Legs, and the newcomer, Boxy Boo. They all offer their own set of abilities in a unique style of play. Whether you wish to be a manic brute like Huggy, quick and nimble with Mommy, or a springy hunter with Boxy, there's a monster to fit the bill. Now the monsters will be trying to sabotage you during this gameplay, and the monsters will always want the element of surprise, so to do that, they're going to be using toy tickets, which can be earned by simply playing the game. You can purchase and upgrade new abilities called sabotages, and these allow you to get the jump on players. Use these to bind the survivors, booby trap their path, and destroy their grab packs. And you heard that right, you are going to be able to play with your grab pack. So these six survivors wield a powerful tool known as the grab pack, with two long extendable arms, and you can do almost anything with them. So you're gonna to need to use this grab pack to carry heavy objects, grabbing something from far away, completing puzzles, and gripping doors to slam shut in the monsters. So a lot of this sounds like the style of Dead by Daylight or even Dragon Ball The Breakers, and that's because, well, it is. That's exactly what we need. We need another really well-made horror game that is like Dead by Daylight, and I love that it's Poppy Playtime theme because that just makes us so much better. Now, the survivors have other things besides their grab pack. They actually have their own set of perks, so they're not limited to any default abilities. You can build your own class with these perks. You can purchase and upgrade perks with toy tickets, with these perks, you can be whatever type of survivor you dream of, be it a puzzle master or a medic, speed demon, or even a shadow walker. However, you want to play is covered. So this game sounds really good, and I gotta say, it actually looks pretty well made. Now we're gonna jump into the actual gameplay footage of it in just a minute. This is going to be official gameplay footage, so I know there's so many videos out there that have like concept arts, and mods and fake gameplay and all that. I promise you what I'm about to show you is gonna be a fully legit. So thank you guys so much for watching. We're gonna show the trailer and uh, if you guys wouldn't mind, hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. I would super, super appreciate it. Hi there, my name's Leif Pierre. And welcome to your job as a resource extraction specialist. <clears> There's <throat> the job. You need to collect toy parts to make a giant toy. Get that giant toy on the train, then leave. Simple, right? 